Hi viewers, I'm Muhammad Ali and you are watching Femolations. Today, in this demonstration video, I will simulate for you a conductor and I will show you how electrostatic induction occurs in the conductors or metals. You can observe here in this diagram that it's a piece of conductor, it's a piece of metal and you all know that electrons keep on randomly moving inside a metal, inside a conductor. So there are a lot of a number of electrons which are moving randomly in a conductor. And on the other side, I have a positively charged body. I can make it negatively charged as well. Positively charged, negatively charged. You just have to observe that what will happen if I bring that either negatively or either positively charged body near that metal. So just assume that if I bring that negatively charged body near that conductor near that metal, what happened? All the electrons got repelled by the negative charged and they are occupying the other side of the conductor and the majority of the positive charge is now on the left side and majority of negative charge is on the right side. So we can say that the metal has polarized. This polarization will cause an attraction between the metal and the charged body. Now we just take it back and you will see that the electrons are again randomly moving in all directions. Let's make it positively charged. Now I am bringing that positively charged metal rod. Wow! Now the electrons are attracting towards the positively charged rod and the positively charged metal is excessively on the right hand. So if I again bring it back, the electrons will again keep on randomly moving in all directions. So let's move forward. Here I am going to show you another simulation that you can even practically demonstrate in your classroom. Just buy a tin can of whatever drink you like, it's Pepsi 7up Coke or whatever. Just drink it and take an empty can which is made up of aluminium and aluminium is a conductor, aluminium is a metal. And metals have free electrons which are randomly moving in all directions. So here let it be the tin can which is made up of aluminium and it has freely moving electrons inside it. Now if I take a positively charged glass rod, the same thing is happening and you can demonstrate or it on any table that just place a tin can on a table and uh, just take a plastic comb, rub it with your hairs and bring it near the tin can and you will see that the tin can will move along with your charged comb as it is attracting towards the positively charged glass rod and what you can see since electrons are mobile so electrons are following the positive charge and making the tin can to move with the electrostatic attraction now just get rid of the glass rod and bring a negatively charged rubber now what you are observing again the tin can is attracting towards the negatively charged rubber rod but this time the electrons are getting repelled and the polarization of the metal is causing the tin can to attract towards the rubber rod. So it was the demonstration about electrostatic attraction and repulsion. I am hopeful that you would have enjoyed this simulation. So just keep supporting us with your attention. Subscribe our channel. Take care. Bye.